Hello everyone, it's like a here yet again with another episode of Chrono Arc. I wasn't planning to actually make another episode. I like this is the same day as the uh as the very short one because I've uh watched a video in which someone with uh three healers managed to do uh the Forgotten King while uh, also in expert mode and honestly i want to try that as well so basically we want to try to maximize healers as many healers as we possibly can so that rules out a hell yeah and selena start because that is one damage dealer um so first off we need to be aware of what our healers can technically be uh we have joey sis Haas, and pressel out of these four the ones with uh, the, the best damage potential are Huzz and Sis. Next uh, is, would be Pressel, and Joey is mainly just a healing bot. So I want to start a run with Sus and his. Huzz and Sis. <laughs> Yikes. Let's try it. It's gonna be a, such a bad idea, but we're gonna try it anyway. Let our little healer party start. Starts with a pile of gold and an unknown scroll. That's already pretty nice. Okay, that's a ra rather hard start. Yeah. Yep, dragon. Stop! Okay, this one's dead. Uh, we get our basic heal. Our goal is to make Huzz more damage based, but for that we need to start with leveling Sirius because of, uh, of Dolly. And. Hmm. Bird of Life is great. And Incise. Uh. Let's fix Fred of Life. Even though, actually, no, don't. Let's don't. No, let's not do that. It's a bit too. So we should have probably taken Eve Guard, but I kind of wanted an AOE heal, so I didn't do that. Another voice log. So I've looked at the uh, video log, but it's the same I already see. I have already seen before, so I'm gonna show that to you on another day. All right. Now we deal somewhat sufficient damage. Very nice. See, it already got very much easier. Camouflage cloak, eh? Damn. None of these were what we wanted. I would put it onto someone, but it could be very much cursed. So let me actually enchant it first. Also, with this setup, we're we'll be having an easier time to. Um, We'll be having an easier time to actually uh, damage the living armor. 
All right, crack is one of the big things that we need for uh, a damage hus, I believe. Because it hits ones, and if the enemy has a debuff, a weakening debuff, uh, we hit every uh, every enemy again for four damage. Okay, and secondly, we should probably take domination. It has a weakening debuff, so it synergizes. So we take this. So Huss is, as we planned, our damage dealer. And Sis is our healing. Hopefully it works out. Let's go. And it is with living armor. I kind of didn't want that to happen, but whatever. You got a mass acceleration. Nice. Probably a bad idea, but we got it. Alright, we have no attack. We do have one now. Why on... Her... Ah, it's... Can you stop attacking one person only? Well, we win. But that was painful. <laughs> Alright. Uh, zero to two hundred percent of healing. Not sure I like that. But let's go on to the next stage. You can increase max mana and draw, uh, add one draw card. I want to have... Ooh. Uncontrollable Dole has the uh, potential to be the best card here. Okay. Let's see what we get. Uh, we get no other damage, we get no other healer. Technically, Charon can be a healer with, uh, with Dark Bless. Uh, hmm. Leon could, uh, I always want to pick Leon when I see her. Funnily enough, a video I saw did have Leon in it. So honestly, I do want to use her. I would have used her regardless. Let's be real. Golden skill book. Hmm. Uh. Uh. Difficult. Take pain equals happiness. And we give this to Sis for now. Alright. We don't have anything to level the in with, which is fine. We could do that fight. Yeah, why not? No, oh, sorry. Do you like whips? Uh, quite forward, aren't we? This is uh weird. One enemy dead. Uh. Ah.
Okay, do we get it to tank? We do. So my biggest problem right now is not having attacks. Yep. Very good. It. All right, we got it. That's a level up for Leon right here. Yes. That relentless swipe and stunning smite. Good skills. Really good skills. Take this criminal's ring, eh? Hmm. This is a transfer, and this is a mapping scroll. Helpful because now we know where we. There's no fight nearby. So it can be in those places too, eh? Alright, now we need a lifting scroll or a pre purification scroll to actually unlock that. This is great. Actually, I want to wait. I want to wait until I find a... Until I know what's in this place. Vitality scroll, of course. And these two. Not this, but this yeah skill book goes on her this synergizes with the other thing probably the best thing we can take here that's boss over there There's a lot of potions here. I don't know what any of them do. Okay, that's BK Jog. Damn it. Bonk. Okay, we got domination, that's nice. Swiftness? It is swiftness. Alright, one of them is down. Attacks the wrong person, that's fine. All, only happens all the time. Stop! Jesus! They really do not stop attacking Sis. We have two lifting scrolls, one of them we need. Gold apple? Nah, just the first gold. In that case, we use both our uh, purple equipment to make a new one. Forbidden bubble and the camouflage cloak.
Huh, it's Leon's sword. I take it. Okay. Hmm. I think I tried teamwork here yet again. Potential can also make common skills, and common skills are usually just bad. So I don't want to risk that. This was a forge, right? Yeah, this was a forge. In that case, actually, let me level house to three. Uh, constrict could be good. Oh yes, give and take. We could use give and take. Hmm. Is Constrict. Restrained here. Perfect. Counter and attack. That's the skill of Revenger. Nice. Uh, we can put incise here and it's dead all right now my biggest problem right now is scissors health i do want to level you up uh time to move is really okay actually Ooh, we can even level leon up you get a drop down slash Only the boss left? Only the boss left. Uh, sis, you're gonna eat two bread. Actually, let's go to the forge again. And forge the two green equipments to a, to a blue one. And honestly, I take it. Both effects are great on uh, sis, so why not? That was a purification scroll. I hate it. Uh, we do not know what any of our potions do, so let's go to this and identify two or three of them. Debuff enhance. Energy drink. Weakening enhance. Okay, weakening enhance definitely goes on to us. This we still don't know what it does. Next thing will be cast twice. Start with a vitality scroll and let's go into the boss fight. Oh no, Sir Dorchi the fourth. I am not ready. <laughs> Would you please take a look at the situation? What is your life? You are still almost dead.
Okay, now I now you have that. Okay. Luckily you will not attack this turn, so I could technically just drop down slash this. Alright, Thread of Light is up. What? I thought it was on... Ah, oh, I missed it. Okay. Okay. Not sure it works like this, but let's use it anyway. No, it doesn't. Nice. That was actually good. Because this allows me to actually completely heal back up. Okay, I want to keep a relentless slash. Drop down. Now I can use crack. Okay. You will not give up. Stand by, we'll swipe all of these die. Righteous stab onto her, she gets Revenger. And she dies! Yo, that was actually pretty solid! I mean, considering that we use a party of mostly healers. <laughs> Damn! Max of Rage, really good, nice, I take it. Let's go to the next stage. Didn't think I would actually have such an easy time against Sir Dorchi. Okay, we have a feeling we could go preparation, hello. There is literally no other option. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, I want to add in our draw card. We're already three people of level three. Uh, AC counter. And let's add a skill book onto you. 
if Dar is willing really good and healing wave is okay. This might sting is actually the best one here. Especially if we pair it with pain equals happiness. Okay, you take uh you go on Leon, because Leon is our counter queen. And then we go on to the next stage. Didn't think that Hot Sis would be such a great start. Oh. Okay. Gonna look at that later. We still have a key left, so let's take it. Get a ghost badge, that's not so great. What was this again? Debuff enhance. We don't really have a big debuffer at this moment. We do still have a lifting scroll. I might want to take the other directions first. Don't want to start this fa uh, with the stage with a cursed enemy if I can somewhat avoid it. We do get another uh, lifting scroll, we do get this, we cannot get the key. Okay, what is our uh, setup so far? Most skills are on, actually you can forget Basic heal, yeah. Protect us better. So Huss has a lot. Huss has an absolute lot. We could fix pain equals happiness at this point and forget the heal. Because if we if we can apply this... Actually, it's a once skill. So... Hmm. In that case, we might... Ah, uh, we cannot fix life barrier? Damn. Then we fix this might sting. It costs free, but we might get a... Uh, we got, might get an, a purple equip that reduces the cost of uh, pain stuff. As for you, I would like to have Eve guard at some point. Oh, patch up. That's a good skill, for sure. Right, we can go here. So Leon is in general really good at this stage because there are a lot of enemies here. You'll just use inflate blue and there's no point. Okay, we actually got both enemies here. Very nice. Alright, you do have drop down slash. You expand. You die. Then we can use concentrate on this one. We restrain him. The fun thing is this uh, this usually just uses my extra uh, my extra mana that I get for parrying. Which makes it super good to use. Ooh, carrot and stick. Alright, uh Hmm. You don't actually have dead end. Scales with healing power. Huh. Hmm. 
Well, these will not move anymore, so whatever. No need to restrain. And that's why. Uh, they will not attack. But there's no real way to do this. We're all stunned. Great. Uh, us literally doesn't have any other skill. Yikes! This is a interestingly well uh, well-rounded party. I did not expect that. I did not expect this party to actually be this smooth. Minus one healing power, eh? Not that Leon cares about healing power. All right, any place here that. Feels like it should have a hidden thing. Yeah, for sure. Well, you definitely restrain it. I might want to use my lifting scroll here. Unless I draw. Okay. Lift this. I don't want this to attack three times. Not nice. Okay. Perfect. God, this is so smooth. I do want to upgrade my max mana. At some point. I have a lifting scroll. Another forge. This place looks so suspicious. Still not it. Man. Sometimes I just cannot figure out where the where the things are. Mm, restrain one of them. Perfect. I wanted that. Relentless swipe. He will attack two people. And now he should die, yep. Hmm, sure, let's distract one of my mouses. Revenger is turned on. That was an interesting interaction, wasn't it? Alright, that's another mana. I do not possess a key, but I have the money to buy it. Okay, it was a meet us scroll. That was very important to know. That is also more money for me.
This could transform into another rare item. Actually, let's do that with this one. I mean, I take it. More healing is always great. Could have also waited until I opened this. Crescent Cape. Nah. I don't like Crescent Crate uh, Cres Crescent Crate too much. It's minus twenty percent max health, so like she loses five. Though well, I suppose you could coop that on on Huzzy. Better than nothing. What was this? This was a forge. And this was the enchantment. Okay. Mm, let's just go in. What is this actually? Greater heal. Yeah, no. It costs free. Big tank. Ooh. Okay. We can restrain him. That is very funny. Let's not do it though. Kaboom. Everyone's almost dead. I have just about one turn to make sure we can live again. Strike back onto you. As you can see, it is not easy to get life. Ah, I hear this before. Okay. Definitely restrained. We need the obstruction here, because otherwise someone might die. Do we have two stacks? You should have two stacks. Nice. Everyone is al uh, everyone is alive now. That was important. That was also a lot of damage. Uh, okay. Pain equals happiness is for next. Actually, no, for this turn. You heal yourself, we end turn. Then we life barrier. Uh, with all least life, you do. We could also cast this might sting, but let's start with domination. Wreck. We can attack is very important. Perfect. And redraw teamwork. Fun fact. Bonk. This stun is very important. No need to restrain. Okay. Constrict. Uh, you take the damage. We use. Ah, wait, it's on the wrong person. Restrained for sure. We use this. Plus, use this. Perfect! 
and we come back with full life. Except for Sis, she's missing some. Honestly, this was really well done. I cannot believe that this party works as well as it does. Damn. All right, let's see who our last member is going to be. I hope it's either Joey or Pressel. Ah, if, if we go for full healer, it will be Pressel. And Pressel could also wait uh, with damage. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what? I want to live the meme. I do want to live the meme. And with Leon and the Hust already dealing good damage... Actually, Narhan builds the healing role as well, but I want to use Pressel. I want to use Pressel. Let's use Pressel. I don't care. Let's go. Uh... Kill it would be great with uh, Crack. So we take Kill it. And then we take Holy Light because that's uh, really good. Blinking Heal also very good. Skill Book onto you. Get Healing Coil. Insane. And now we have a Pressel. Holy Light is good enough to actually be a big skill, even if it costs free if we do. But then we need 6 mana to actually use it well. Just, just look at this team. I cannot, I cannot believe that it works so well so far. This, this is a, this is a meme. I love it. But let's continue. And this is all the time it's fair to give Liam both debuff and hands potions. It's gonna only be an enchanting scroll or ID scroll, so... Ooh, a barrier potion. Meh. I do have a lifting scroll for that, so that will be okay. Another ID scroll. We can finally find out what the last potion does. Ooh. Nope. It's a double-edged sword. It could be really good, but it could also kill me. Loosh. That's that. This is just healing. We know that. We know our enemies here. Uh, we take on control of the doll. I mean, why not? Okay. Can actually use teamwork here. Even more, even more counter. This should be it. All right, only she's left. Uh, we take healing coil. Kill it. Also, great job. Why is this so good? Use Constrict for Disarm, use this for more damage. With the end of the party, we don't even need that much mana. So we get so much. 
I get one more mana, and after this, I will only level and get some more draw cards. So there's no reason for me to level more. There really is no reason. I don't have bread. Balloons! Alright. We open Relentless right. Relentless swipe. Uh, I don't care. Okay. We take pain equals happiness. Uh, I kind of want teamwork. More balloons. You use this and we pass turn. <laughs> yeah, this still works. What the hell is this party? I'm sorry, what? Okay. I want to get one more draw skill, I think. I think a draw skill would be beneficial here. Or should I level up Leon? I think I'll level up Leon here. And get a second Relentless Swipe, because why the hell not? This is a forge. Can I actually forge anything of worth? Not yet, I need to unlock the... I need to unlock the shop. Just a big woman. No relentless really swipe on our hand. Hmm. Little relentless swipe on hand. Okay. Finally, relentless swipe. They watch your wall, but this works way too well. Another relentless white, we take that.
We can pass here. She dies from the preparation. Hey, it took us teamwork. I take that. Another prep, okay. Cool. Free nomination. Nope. Sloosh. Red aura. That should kill already. And a firecracker does the rest. What the hell? Okay, we get a key, we get both ID scrolls and this. Wrestle. Oh, Eve Gar is too good to pa uh, to pass up on. I mean, I get we can debuff very easily, but this is not enough damage to warrant it. Unless I draw it off a Holy Light prophecy, but for that I just need more Holy Light, so I take Holy Light. Makes sense, doesn't it? Another Devil's Elixir, hmm. And an Amulet of Anger. Not a fan of both of them. Lifestone Scepter. I could make a purple one now. No, here. Hmm. Hmm. Crescent Cave on Anger, I get a blue one. And with these, I get a purple one. Not necessarily bad. So, two big things for me are that I do not have a healing potion. I still do not have a healing potion. But other than that, this doesn't look bad. Okay. Nope. The other, only other plays I could... I cannot really imagine a place where there could be a... Nah, I missed it. Whatever. Uh, hmm. We have six. We can level one person and get a card draw. I think I wanna level Sis. Alright, Eve help. Knitting is not too good. Uh. Renovate can be very good. It might go neg, but at the same time we usually have many cards in hand, so it costs zero. It's a little better than Hasty Counter in that regard. So let's let's just try it out. Honestly, I'm really I'm feeling pretty good about this run so far. And now I'm not anymore. Zero and one, okay. Zero one is not a good combination for me. Fuck. Uh, patch up. And we can still use blinking heal onto you. Get you the red aura.
Nope. Three and zero. That means I have to use Penny Cool's happiness here. We play this. Okay, that was nice. If I discard it, nothing happens. Funny. I do not have any cars in hand. This is not looking good. Uh, AC counter. Nice. This is always a boss that kills me. I'm really bad against it. Twice? Oh god. I really don't like this boss. <laughs> yeah, we will just die. Oh no. Sadly, a really, really good run dies to the worst boss in my opinion. I hate this one. I have to use this. And I have no way to kill him. Yeah. Sad, but we die again. I kind of wish, like, for me the, the list of, of bosses for this stage is easiest is the time thing, medium is uh, are, are the twins, 
And for absolute worst case, please do not ever come to me scenario is exactly the boss we had to fight. Gotta be the amount of times we failed, eh? Ah, oh, that was kind of sad because that was a very fun run. Honestly, I might try that again. I really might try that again because that run was extremely fun. Huh. So that's probably Annie from this one. And this one looks like Leon. So it's Leon and Chain. God, Leon looks cute. God, it makes me love Leon even more. Running introduction! Hello, I'm the head manager of the Art Project line. First of all, many of you here, those who supported us. Uh, okay. This phenomenon was found by chance. We have, we have very limited time remaining. The situation where projects are going on in different parts of the country, but the method that most of humanity chose was cryonics. According to the apparatus we keep in touch with, the population has already gone to sleep. Hibernating is a great solution to, a, to this catastrophe. We can accommodate as many people as possible. The problem is that this method is not perfect. The biggest problem is, as you all know, this phenomenon is going to stay around on Earth for a long period of time. Not only that, there's a possibility that the period could be astronomical, so it's possible to predict it accurately. At most, we need to think about a thousand years. The possibility of them waking up is very slow. Very low. As for a worst case scenario, they might end up forever. Humanity. Therefore, we started the Ark Project so that we could preserve until that point. The Ark Project is a revolutionary way to maintain our daily lives during the Grand Catastrophe. In the Ark, everything you need to sustain in life. The Ark. Sustainable and keep everything safe during... Many cannot keep for the other alternatives. Even if you cannot be on the Ark, a sleeping facility nearby, I... Right after the Grand Catastrophe. Alright. But yeah, that's unfortunately a very early end to this exceptionally fun run. However, this is not the last run we've do we'll be doing, so don't fret. We'll try that again. Until then... I hope you guys have a wonderful time. See you guys in the next episode of Chrono Arc or even Library of Runa. Whatever you guys prefer. Bye-bye.